What's up, YouTube? It's your boy T. Back again today with another Soul Supremacy Beater Box. Hey man, I'm a little excited about this box. This one is $815. This is the most expensive box I've had in a while. Um, just haven't been getting lucky with the higher end boxes, but to me, this would be considered not necessarily the highest, not the lowest, a little higher than the mid. It's a good chunk of change, man. $815. If you're new to the channel, these are mystery boxes, man. We get them from a company called Soul Supremacy out in the Bay Area of California. Uh, it's exclusive members only. I don't know when memberships will be opening up. Um, we buy them every week on Sundays. And it's a complete mystery. I don't know what's inside this box, what condition, what sizes, what models, any of that. Just a complete mystery, man. Just for those who are new to the channel, if you stumbled up on this video, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. I got a lot more boxes coming in. So with that being said, we're gonna jump into this one. Like I said, it's 815 bucks. I'm excited about it. Haven't had one this expensive in a while. Hopefully I got something to be excited for. Guess we just have to see. Holidays, holidays, holidays. Hope everybody had a uh, Merry Christmas. Happy holidays to all y'all who watching these videos, man. Spend time with your family. All right, we in here. Off top, I got two pair without boxes. I guess I could do those first. No, I'm gonna do this first. Just cause it's the Under Armour Steph Curry. We're gonna go and get this out the way. I got a size eight um, Under Armour Curry four. Steph Curry um, four. I'm not big on Steph Curry's. Um, they look like they'd be a dope hoop shoe. These are, uh, these are dead stock. No, I'm not sure. No, they're not dead stock. They look like they might have been tried on, but I see like a few dirt specs. So I'm not gonna call them dead stock. Maybe tried on. These are really clean, really clean. Size eight, Curry four. I think they up to the Curry five or Curry six now. I don't know. I haven't been um, keeping up with those. These two pair are without boxes. I got a Jordan 10, size 12, no box, uh, pre-owned, has a little bit of a cut. I'm trying to get this thing to focus and it's not focusing. It's focusing on my face. These are pre-owned, size 12. Overall, not too bad. Have a couple of nicks and scuffs on the toe box. Jump man on the back. Jordan Tens don't get no love. Y'all don't show Jordan Tens no love. Alright, we got some Ultra Boosts. I want to say these are called the Any Days. I just got a pair of these in a size 12 not too long ago. The other pair I got was Dead Stock. These are a size 10. And I'm not. I love this colorway. This is actually not a bad shoe to me. Uh, Under Armour any days and it's made out of a lot of premium material if you are familiar with I said Under Armour Ultra Boost if you're familiar with Ultra Boost you've probably seen these or heard of these them curry still on my mind I'm gonna say Under Armour Ultra Boost next up man I got six pair left in this box these are all with box I see a lot of brown ones down here you guys know what come in those brown boxes. Uh, I got a Jordan 12 Retro BG size six and a half. We got some French blues. These have uh, minimal wear on them. These are really clean. This is some this is some heat, man. I wish these was my size. French blues still in great shape. Look like they've been worn just a few times. Just a few times, these are in great shape. I won't even really have to even clean these. And they do have the receipt in the box. <clears throat> I got another size six and a half. Retro 12. All 
right, we got the flu games. Again, in great shape. A little dust on the bottom. The uppers and everything is really clean on them. I don't see the receipt in the box on this one. But these are about the same condition as the French Blues. Very clean. Probably one of my favorite 12s. GR release, but it's still, this is still a fire shoe, man. French Blues and Flu Games. Both size six and a half. We got some more Ultra Boost. Yeah, this box got some heat in it, man. I'm looking at those brown boxes at the bottom. We got some Ultra Boost size 12s. Again, I don't know the, the name of these. They probably some triple white or something like that. And these seem to be dead stock. Just a triple white Ultra Boost. These are dead stock. Um, size 12. I got a few pair of Ultra Boost sitting around here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this Jordan box out of the way. This is my last Jordan, another six and a half, man. You guys know what these are, cool gray 11s. A lot of people's favorite 11s. They need to retro this one. This is a, a super clean shoe. Cool gray 11s. These are pre owned, so let me pull out both of them. I didn't show both of the Ultra Boost because they dead stock. Let's check them out. Still pretty clean. Size six and a half. Any of y'all got kids <laughs> or your girl needs a six and a half, we got them. Dang, why these couldn't be my size, man? All the heat was in the six and a half. All right, next up, I got two brown boxes. I, I say it's some, some heat down here because a lot of y'all really, really love Yeezys. There's still a little bit of a market for them. These are size 10 and a half. Um, 350s. I haven't looked at the color. All right, we got the green, green 350, olive 350s, whatever you want to call them. These are not dead stock, but look like they haven't been worn much at all. See the boost is still pretty white. Get the green stripe on there, olive stripe. Pull out the other one. Size 10 and a half. I will not be keeping these. These will be going up for sale. Um, no receipt. I would have loved to have the receipt when it comes to these. I mean, I came from Soul Supremacy, so I know they're authentic, but I want to have the receipt for whoever purchases them. Last up, this is my first time having this shoe, man. I got a 700, uh, size 12. I'm not gonna look at the color. And it's probably that mauve or however you say it, the last one that dropped. And I'm wrong, we got the first ones, Wave Runners. Size 12, this box should do pretty well. These still go for a nice penny pre-owned. I mean, not like they used to, but between these and the other Yeezys, this box should do really well. This is my first time having these in hand. I've seen them a million times um, on YouTube and pictures on Instagram. This is my first time having this shoe in hand. And a lot of times when I get shoes in hand, sometimes it'll change my mind. Like, all right, these are not too bad, you know? But these shoes, uh, they don't change my mind at all. This shoe is... Uh, Still not my my cup of tea, but if you like it, then rock it, man. Y'all know how I, what I always say, man. If you like it, rock it. Size 12, Yeezy, 700. I'm super happy with this box, man. These, the 350s, all those six and a half. So I find the right person, are gonna move really fast. So yeah, pretty pleased with $815. Um, hopefully have another box for you guys next week. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, got a lot of, lot of.
time off work so hopefully i get some more videos out to you guys um hit the subscribe button follow me everywhere at t guys soul and the for sale page at t guys soul for sale all the links for everything should be down below appreciate your time thanks for watching your boy is out and happy holidays again to you guys um make sure you spend as much time with your family as possible and just relax and enjoy so i'm out peace